Good morning, ladies. TGIF. Yes, it is Friday. And listen, I get a lot of messages, actually. I get a lot of ladies that write me questions, okay? I probably could start my own blog or Dear Abby post at this point, and maybe I will in the future. I don't know. I can't even possibly respond to all these women of all the questions that I get asked over a, a period of time. So um, no disrespect if I haven't gotten back to you yet, but I have thousands of letters in my in my inbox, and it's hard to get to everybody and answer everybody appropriately. But anyway, one of the biggest questions I have been asked, and I'm going to try to answer that, is how did I do it? <laughs> it's kind of a loaded question. How did I do it? Well, it's not what how I did it. It's what I'm actively doing is the answer, okay? Self-development is, is a process, and it's a process that over time it never stops, okay? And I was actually introduced to self-development or whatever you want to call it um, probably about seven years ago, and I can give uh, kudos to network marketing companies because that is one of the biggest things in all network marketing companies I don't care who you are with um, any MLMs direct sales whatever they introduce uh, people to 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 self-development and you know there's a few of us that jump on board and, and, and dive in and, and research and learn um, so my best advice to you ladies is if you want to start somewhere you got to start with reading you got to start with attending um, events where there's motivational speakers, inspirational speakers are at. Uh, you know, it's, it, it costs money to make money, and I can tell you that one thing. I've invested a lot of money over the years in self-development, in, in all the books that I've purchased, all the events that I've attended, all the um, seminars I've been, I've YouTubed, Googled, listened to, read books. I mean, it, it's, it's a never-ending process, and, and it's something that you gotta start somewhere, okay? So there's no real easy answer to, to it all there's no magical secret the secret is is that you got to start it you got to start somewhere and to me it means starting with simply reading a book every morning when I wake up the first thing I do is I read and I switch it up I don't read the same stuff every single day I might read something that has to do with business I might read something that has to do with relationships I might do read something that has to do with leadership motivation anything I switch it up on a daily basis so every day I'm putting something in my head and then from from reading all this stuff uh, starts to form habits okay and then I apply it okay so if you wanna you know start learning about yourself you gotta start researching and you start you gotta start diving into s subjects that interest you um, you know again there's a million topics out there that that could that could jump out at you that you'll be interested in so to answer your question of how I did it I'm still doing it never stop learning ladies I don't care how old you are I don't care how many degrees you have after your you know how many letters you got after your name how successful you think you are already you never stop learning and, and constantly pu putting new information in your head absorbing it from other people I have mentors all over the place right now that I watch, that I follow, that I listen to. Um, there's women in our page that write in Fight Club that I'm following, that I'm watching, that I'm listening to. Okay, Everybody's got little gold nuggets that they're throwing out there to you, and it's up to you to whether you see them or not see them, if you catch them or not. If you're listening to anything I say on this page or not, it's up to you. But the key is, is to open your ears open your eyes and start paying attention to what's going on around you and the people and 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 take into consideration people who you think are successful in life start picking their brains asking them questions i've picked a lot of brains i continue to pick brains i never stop with that so you know find something some kind of trade or uh, a trait i say i mean to say of somebody that you think is uh successful for whatever it is in their life it doesn't have to be business it could be relationships it could be parenting it could be uh, fitness it could be health and follow them and and start picking their brains so that's my best advice for you today is uh, start somewhere if you're really interested in learning self-development because let me tell you something you will be a happier person because of it I am so consciously aware now that it, it's almost frightening to me at this point that I can I can be in a, in a in a room full of people now and things that would irritate me before don't bother me anymore Things that I would debate, I don't debate anymore because I'm so in tune with myself that I'm not worrying about what's going on with everybody else. Okay, so um, there you have it today. There's uh, me, you know, coffee talk with me, Mall, <laughs> or whatever. I hope you enjoy your Friday and uh, get out there and learn something new today. Peace out.